Hey everyone, welcome to the video. My name is Owen and in this video I decided to flip it on because I was inspired to make a little video to show you um, just an easy way to get in some nutrients and to heal yourself physically, to help yourself emotionally and mentally and to give you a boost mentally, bodily, spiritually, emotionally. So, wasn't it? Here I am, so welcome to the video, lots of love and I hope you're well today and enjoy this video and just get a little snippet out of it, just a little bit of inspiration, it's really easy. Um, this one is made from oranges and three small oranges, two grapefruits, big enough, and one organic cucumber. And I made the video because when I do these juices, I always feel so much better. It's a fantastic way to boost and nourish your system, your brain, your mind, your eyes, your, your muscles, your skeleton, your bones, your teeth. And usually if it was daytime, I'd go outside and I'd pick a bunch of dandelion leaves and maybe some nettles and maybe some dock leaves and sometimes some grass and that is where the real deep mineralization which is great for your bones come in and that's where the real deep richness of amino acids which is superior plant plant plants deliver superior protein than animal sources by the way without causing the acidic um, bone demineralization that the animal foods do So, I'll show you over here for a second. I'm just cooking some wild mushroom soup, which I got from field mushrooms. So, it's not like I just only eat raw foods necessarily. Some days I do, like I just did three days worth a few days ago, and I did a lot of semi fasting a little bit. This is really nice a few little potatoes, a bit of this bouillon and um, some potatoes and onions so that was pretty simple soup and um, whoops the daisy so let me go over here i do encourage you to um eat plant-based foods my brother was thinking about doing vegan for a week oh i have to lower this again it's making noises It's truly life-changing effects, and I also do believe that Jesus in the book, which was written down in the book, the Essene Gospel of Peace, that um, that wasn't exactly written, included in the Bible, you know? <laughs> You'd want it to be, but it wasn't. But it's sort of like the most practical part. Um, of the Bible, but it was omitted. But he just talks about living foods and sun cooked foods, sun prepared foods. But it's okay, obviously, to have cooked foods. There's nothing wrong with that. Um, it's not a doesn't have to be a dogmatic religion type of idea where you become, you develop a shadow, you develop, you know, self suppression and repression where you, and then you start criticizing yourself. You eat some soup or cooked foods. It's not like that. And that's not what the religions or Jesus would have talked about either. That's what develops the shadow, you know, the, the suppression and the repression, the self-criticism, the non-whole body, whole being acceptance. You know, so I'll just put this on so I won't run for too long. Um, but yeah, plant protein is far superior than animal protein, which has saturated fats and too much cholesterol and arterial and blood vessel clogging, placking and materials in it and it's acidifying, you know, especially the, the non-organic stuff or the wild stuff. If I was to eat meat, which I haven't for like, I don't, I haven't for seven years, except for once, just tried it, that's a different story, because it's Christmas and they're throwing it in the bin and I just thought, eh, they keep asking me and they're throwing it in the bin, they got loads of food, so. but it didn't suit me, it didn't go well with me at all. Yeah. <laughs> nah, but um, if I was to eat meat, I'd, if, if I would recommend another person, for example, does it have a once or twice a week max 
kind of nice enough or tiny quantities um, and it's organic as well so try it organic but uh, otherwise just enjoy your juices guys no matter what your bad habits even if you're like a heroin user don't beat yourself up about it and do have your juices <laughs> get the healthy stuff in regardless and you'll notice a positive difference and it will help fight any acidosis from stress or or just from meat or, or, or dairy dairy is clogging and acid forming but I don't want to talk or focus on what's bad for you in this video I really want to focus on what's good for you eat your fruits, don't eat too much and don't have too much sex you know, too much sex can be extremely tiring and uses up a lot of resources, especially if you're a man and you, you, you know, you use semen producing outwards. But um, all in moderation in life, um, healthy things, just have balance and moderation, you know. Do your best, appreciate what you have and learn from your mistakes, learn as you go along and uh, you will be doing so well and you'll really notice a big difference so definitely would suggest not too much sex or sexual activity don't overeat loads either because they're two of the most tiring things you could possibly do Peep. there's a, like a, a 100 year old marathon runner and he just his secret is he says he eats like a child it's very small quantities and that means you don't overburden your system and you give all your digestive system a break you don't clog your system too much either and then when you eat food, your system's had a really good break and it will really have the strength and energy, the power and, and vitality to absorb all the nutrients and hopefully to utilize them as well. So the only other thing I'd recommend as well as juices in general is absolutely do exercise. It's so important. Like try to get your heart pumping every day. Do some skipping or a mixture of skipping, press-ups, sit-ups, pull-ups, or even one or two or three of them, cycling, fast walking, jump, jumping jacks, stretching and um other stuff like that to like pump your lymph system and your blood system and um, and balance the body mind and spirit meditation and things that you like you only live once don't forget in this lifetime so don't do what other people want you to do necessarily do what you want to do follow your heart and do what you like um, do what you like so much be as happy as you can and uh, try and make other people as happy as you can if you can because that's a really nice thing you know for everybody you included so, um, anything else? Okay, so I got like three cups out of this, um, and the only thing I'd really recommend for health generally is um, fasting sometimes, like even if it's one or two or three or four hours after you get up, because when you sleep you fast, so that will really help your, your life and your health. Um, and another thing, we take herbs and superfoods, it's because the soils are being depleted, so when you take superfoods or else wild foods, like I was saying earlier, like from the garden, it's like super mineral rich. It will help alkalize and super mineralize your body, which is great for all your organs, brain, lungs, heart, everything. And don't forget the plants and the, the plant amino acids, the greens, they're really, and the plant proteins, like they're very good um, for muscle building, like chia seeds or nuts or seeds, or else the dark green leafy vegetables, or just green leafy vegetables in general. And another thing I'd say is take herbs, so you can check my herb shop below, Higher Yourself Herbs, and I have fantastic herbs there, really good for supporting your adrenals, I'd recommend the Hoshuu and the Rejuvenate. Or if you want others for specific conditions, have a look on my website, ownfox.org, or even just the Higher Yourself Herbs. So I hope that video helped, and I'm sending lots of love, and thanks for joining me, and wishing you a great day. Don't forget, you only live once in this lifetime, so make the most of it, and do what you like. Lots of love, take care, bye. Wish you the best, as always.